It's been barely a fortnight since Nokia unveiled its 41 megapixel Lumia 1020, but the Finnish mobile manufacturer is already back with a new budget friendly proposition the Lumia 625. It has a 4.7 inch touchscreen, 4G compatibility, and is priced at around £200 SIM free. We'll take a look at its three key features and judge whether it's worth snapping up. Most mid-range smartphones skimp on screen size, but the Nokia Lumia 625 comes with a huge 4.7 display. That means it's bigger than the iPhone 5 and BlackBerry Z10, although you'll receive significantly less detail with its 800 by 480 resolution screen when watching video. At a price of £266, Sony's Xperia SP was the cheapest phone you could buy if you wanted to receive 4G. The Lumia 625, priced at just over £200, has now stolen that crown, although contracts for the mobile service itself remain pricey. Whereas the recent Lumia 1020 features a 41 megapixel camera for super detailed shots, the Lumia 625 has only got a 5 megapixel lens. This means your photos won't come out at the quality of more premium phones, but they should be okay for sharing on the likes of Facebook and Twitter. 4G for just over £200 is a tempting proposition that the Lumia 625 lives up to on first impressions. Its 1.2GHz processor and 8GB of internal storage aren't a world-beating combination for speed, but they'll make do for everyday smartphone tasks like streaming music or browsing the internet. Of course, 4G contracts are still fairly expensive, costing around £26 per month for 500 megabits of data. Prices should get more competitive when the likes of Vodafone and O2 launch their services later this year. Of course, 4G contracts are still fairly expensive, costing around £26 per month for 500 megabytes of data. Prices should get more competitive when the likes of Vodafone and O2 launch their own services later this year. With a great big easy to read touchscreen and Nokia's typically colourful design, I think the Lumia 625 could prove a hit with budget-minded phone owners when it launches next month. I'm certainly looking forward to seeing how it performs when we get its results back from our test lab. For our full look at the Nokia Lumia 625, our guide to what is 4G, and a first look at the Nokia Lumia 1020, head over to Witch Tech Daily.